So I'm really excited because today um, I'm going to go see Mark Anthony. Um, I don't remember the last time I did anything for myself. So I can't wait. I gotta get ready real quick. I'm not gonna have much time to do it because my friend's picking up in a little bit. So I still have to get showered and do my makeup, do my hair. I'm in a rush, but I do wanna say I finally got to get my toes done, which I never get to do. It's been like three months since the last time I could remember. Um, so I just got out of the shower. Now I just gotta do my makeup and I am in a rush. So I don't know how this is gonna turn out, but it's gonna have to, it's gonna just have to do, so. I went with this black, which is very uh, comfortable for me. I also love it because it has um, pockets and um, it's a little more slimming. I'm still a little on the heavy side. So as you can see, I've got my belly, but I am working on it. So just day by day and I'm trying to eat better. I want to feel better. So here's to a wonderful night. I'm nervous because I haven't been out in so long on my own, but at the same time, I'm really excited um, because I'm gonna meet some friends and I'm gonna see Mark Anthony and I'm just so, 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 so excited. And um, yeah, I can't wait. And I know Liam and Vivi are gonna have a blast. They always do. They just have this amazing bond that, I don't know, it's unexplainable. So I totally trust her. I know she's great with them, so. And if not, then um, if they're not coming home, then they'll probably be at their grandma's um, where he loves to be there. So I'm excited. I will keep you guys updated, take some pictures, and I will be seeing you guys later. Love you guys. Bye. What's up, Lesby fam? Hey, so this weekend um, I had some time to myself finally. Um, I almost didn't know what to do with myself. So my best friend um, bought me some tickets to go see Mark Anthony. And can I tell you, oh my God, it was an amazing show. He, he was great. Um, I was a little 
reluctant to go only because I haven't been out in so long that I didn't know how to feel about Liam leaving Liam alone. Um, mind you, I know he's safe with Vivi. I know she's a great mom, but um, I think still some of my postpartum issues um, don't really allow me to be at ease. Um, not saying she's not a good mother or that I fear that anything's going to happen to him, but I think it's just my own issues, um, which I'm still dealing with. You know, I thought postpartum was gone after like, you know, six months, a year, whatever. It's It's been almost two years and I'm still going through it. So sometimes I still have a hard time um, being away from him um, just because sometimes in my head I play things like, oh my God, like, what if he falls? I'm not there to protect him. Like, it's just crazy things that I think in my mind. And I mean, I shouldn't because I know Vivi's a great mom, but I don't know. I, I can't help but to feel that way. Um, and um, I'm still taking my meds. I'm kind of on and off. And, you know, some days I have a good day and others are not so great. But um, I'm trying to find ways to deal with it without it affecting us. Um, and so, yeah, I have my struggles, but I, I know that they always have such a great time together. Um, even when I just go to the store or something like, I know they have a great time. And, um, so that makes me feel good. And I know Vivi like is so good with them, like the way they play together, um, the way, she feeds them. I'm like, dude, she eats, he eats more with her than he does with me, which makes me so upset sometimes because I'm like, what the hell? Like, do you not like what I cook you? Like, I don't know. I get butt hurt. Um, but yeah, she does a really, really good job with him. And I don't know. It's just me and my own issues that I wish I could um, somehow fix. And I don't know how to do it quite yet without my meds. Um, but I know they had a great time. And I know Liam, I think they went to uh, Grandma's house, which is so nice because I know Grandma's there. If anything happens, of course, you know, Grandma knows what to do. Mom does too, and she's great. And... I couldn't have asked for a better partner in life, to be honest. Um, she's just so awesome, and I trust her 100%, but again, it's just me and my issues that really don't allow me to fully, um, I don't know, relax. Um, I guess some of my fears are, I'm just not there. You know, and things happen in, in, in a matter of seconds. And, you know, I feel like I need to be in control of everything. I need to be there if something happens. Um, so, I don't know. It just... Um, but, I, I mean, overall, I had a great time. I didn't have much time to get ready. So, it was kind of like get off work go home shower get ready real quick and my friend picked me up and then you know we had um some drinks on the way so that allowed me to kind of relax which was kind of awesome because i feel like they're like dude you are so seriously tense right now like you need a fucking drink so have a fucking drink so i did i had a drink and it helped me relax a little bit um and then at the end of it all i mean i had such a blast um, the next day, I actually woke up with a little bit of a hangover, which was not fun, but it wasn't much because I only had a couple of drinks. Um, but yeah, I had such a blast. I, I couldn't rest for a better night. Um, and then actually right after that, since it ended kind of early, 
um, we wanted to eat. And so we actually ended up um, at this little gay bar, which there was like three people in there. Um, and we got charged eight bucks per person to go in when there was like three people in there. Literally, it was like the two bartenders and these two other guy, gay guys that were there. And then these two white girls came in. Oh my God, they were freaking hilarious. They were so much fun. Um, we danced with them and the gay guys and they were teaching us how to dance and twerk. Can I tell you how much fun I had? So it's just learning how to relax for me um, that I need to practice a little bit better. Um, all right, Lesby fam. First off and most, thank you so much for always watching us. I just got home. I've got to go put all these uh, groceries away from all my shopping today. But I just wanted to thank you all. Ew, did you just fart? Good Gino. <laughs> always something with this kid. But yes, thank you guys all very much for supporting us, giving us all this love. You know, please share with everybody your friends, your coworkers, anybody, you know, we, we love, um, you know, your, your comments. We need them. We love them. Um, when you watch them, you know, give us a thumbs up, a like, you know, something that shows us that, you know, that you guys, that you guys love us. Um, and essentially we're doing this for you guys. So, you know, don't forget to like and comment and subscribe. And um, thank you guys always, always for showing us so much love. Love you guys. Till next time.